Well, good morning, and welcome back to the show. Hope everyone had a great weekend. We're starting off with these huge lights again. We had these once before. I was like, oh, Jeff would love these. He didn't want them because they're a little too modern. You'll see that we're starting off with all kinds of junks here in the back of the trailer. We did some, we did some cleaning this weekend. And I was gonna leave it and possibly do a second run. Um, but decided to keep my neighbors happy and get rid of it quickly this morning. Ooh, you're gonna try to break on me. You're not gonna do that. So we uh, took it with us. So we're starting off with a half of a first layer. But uh, monies have been hit or miss, especially since we do not have our connect into that new neighborhood. It'd be interesting to see if Kev's able to get back in that neighborhood again. Cause he had a connect last week like i had a connect the week before not sure if it's gonna work for me again or not because mine did not so uh hopefully he's able to get into there because there's some good sweet stuff in there so uh let's get on and see what the street has for us today wow this is this is old or maybe it's meant to look old one of the two but i think it's old I think it's a reproduction to look old. Track increments, CD recorder. I don't think, I don't think it's old. <laughs> CD recorder, volume tuning. Oh, cool, look at that. You can tune the radio like old school. That's fun, huh? Should we look through it? I don't know, that top's a little beat up. I don't know, maybe we'll look this one up. Let's uh, let's put her here. Let's look, let's look her up before she gets charged. What's on the side there? Oh, that's a tape. Wow, tape, CD, tuner. Interesting. Look that up, guys, look it up. This particular neighborhood, I've never been in before because um, they've gated and they're always closed. Look at this, you think there's stuffs in there? Nope, these are just muffers. <laughs> Makes me kind of want to get in here every week, huh? Look at this. What do we got? <laughs> sea striker. Go in there. That's a keeper, keeper, keeper. Oosh. Hey, my <laughs> oh, I don't want to scratch my radio player. Still haven't fixed my uh, wall yet. What is this? Wow. A towel warmer. Now that's... That's living fancy, man. You got a towel warmer? What? Is there a TV in this? <clears throat> nope. There's all kinds of sweet, sweet metals underneath it. You go up here, and you guys all come. Bless you guys. You guys get out from under there. Whoosh. Dang it. Don't do that, guys. Come on, man. Now! Hopefully we can fish that out. Losing metals to the gutters. Oh, yeah. oh. Oh. Gotcha! Gotcha! Okie dokie. Relax, brah. Relax. I could go into Chill's little shack. Relax. Feel the zen. Uh. Ooh, that is wall action right there, folks. We need you. Come on over here, Mr. Screen. Onward. 
neighborhoods continuing to produce. We got some art. There's something here. I don't know what these guys are. You are plastic. Um, I think this is extruded down here. What do you got down here? That is flooring. Uh, I wish you weren't all soggy. Kind of different. Not gonna do me any good though, cause y'all wet. Come on, guys. Everybody to the party. Um. Hmm. Let's put you down here like such. I don't get a washer and a dryer, otherwise it's gonna be a pain in the patootie. Hee <laughs> hee. Snuck in Kevin's gated neighborhood again. <laughs> Last week got a stove. This week we're gonna get, look at these fans, look at the size of these paddles, man. What are these? Big old palm fronds. Yeah, I ain't snapping these ones, guys, sorry. <laughs> they feel like, they feel like face busters to me. Face busters. But we're fans of fans here at Not Just Stuff, so uh, take a moment to smash that like button. Hashtag fan of a fan. That's all we got there. I know, this is pretty puffy. We're taking it down. That's from Ikea. I should be a spokesperson for Ikea. I'm always saying, that's from Ikea. It's very, you can tell pretty quickly what's from Ikea and what's not. Look at these guys, these are fun. Those are definitely different. I'm gonna take these just cause they're cool. <laughs> just cause they're cool. Probably worth millions. Still have that large print Bible, never heard from you, Mr. Dad. Come on, shoot me an email, brother. Do it. Look at this thing. That's pretty cool too, huh? I don't think I won't keep this one now. But Matt! <laughs> don't but Matt me. Oh my gosh, you're heavy. Yeah! We're fans of heavy fans at Nacho Stuff. <laughs> A wire in here. You attached anything? No. That looks uh, pretty garbagey. That looks pretty empty. And that's all she wrote. Okay, wire goes in the good bin. You can come over here in the shred bin. All right, let's move it on. Ooh, what do we got here? I love boxes like this. I think they're all empty though. Come on, man. <laughs> Just talking about how I love boxes like this. Oh, you love empty boxes, Matt? Yeah, I do. I love empty boxes. Dang it. This neighborhood's so thick, we're gonna get a threefer. I'm not taking those balloon tanks because they're really light and I gotta put a hole in them. I ain't just doing that. So I just make a habit of not bringing them. You're still really light. Yep, you're still really light. They didn't get heavy overnight. That's because they're full of helium. There's one. Number two's our tester. Number three's gonna be a bike. Oosh. Oh, I thought that was Kev. Being like, what you doing in my neighborhood again? <laughs> Nope, just a truck. All right, let's slide up and get our bike. Get out of here. Let's see if we can find some other stuffs. Ooh, two bikes maybe. Back to the white wheels. Ay, 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 ay. All right. The towel. 
This is a Schwinn. Schwinn bike. <clears throat> Well, both of these are Schwinn's. This is the Schwinn Jasmine. All right, let's go. Another hot chair, and I think they're gonna be part of an air conditioner over there. I think I see a handler. Let's go look. You can come right here. Well, they're like such. Hold it further than I wanted to because I think he might be leaving. Oh, it's not a air conditioner, it's a pool heater. Even better. Got the yummy still in you. I think you does, maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Yes. You're all still in there. Yummy. And by the way, guys, someone's telling me there's like 50 pounds of copper in there. There's not. There's like 15. I don't know where these 50 pound copper ones are at, but they don't live in my neighborhood. You're good, brother. You're good. You're not trying to go this way, are you? I love those new Broncos. I do, I think they're sharp. And I'd love it if I had my dolly with me. What, what's a dolly, Matt? I've never heard of a dolly before. <laughs> oh, no. oh, I know, guys. Sue me. I does what I does. That's just the way life goes sometimes. Mad too. That's a good one. I'm glad it's trying that this morning, man. I haven't found one of those in a while. I think he's tossing this. You get rid of this, Edger? Yeah. All right, appreciate you, man. Have a great one. And it runs. Nice skill, Edger. Weed whacker combination. We'll take that. Oh, yeah, we're still getting trees. I had to pull up because that guy was trying to get through. It is going to be a whole tree. That's a nice bag, too. I'll we'll take Dirt Devil while we're here. This is shaped up to be a pretty nice morning here. I know. I didn't close my door. Sue me! <laughs> Let's go. Looks like we're getting our staples today, too. Because here's some bed rails. Ooh, they've got an umbrella, too. Hey, does anybody use this HelloFresh? I've, uh, I've seen it a lot. I see it a lot on the road. I wonder if it's any good. Leave me a comment if it's tasty. <clears throat> I just think that shopping for six, that can't be very affordable. Just saying. But I did find, I think it's called Something Breeze. It was like a dissolving, uh, detergent packet that you order. They come in like sheets. It looked pretty cool and it wasn't super expensive. If I figure out what it is, maybe I'll let you guys know. <laughs> I gotta look it up at home and I'll uh, let you know in a future video if I can remember what the name of it is. Let's go. Hey, we're checking those on the way back. Those are a whole bunch of tools. What? America's Favorite Game Show. Do we have our compressor or not? It's not looking great, <gasps> but it is, yes! The game show wins once. I hope you work. I need a new one of these. Mine isn't big enough for my needs. The 
fact that you're in a box and in the garbage does not speak well for you working, but I hope you do. Another threefer. And you know what? That's my dishwasher, I think. The one that's currently not working properly. We got a grill and a horse up there. We've got, what did you say? Remember how I found that motorcycle one and I couldn't read what it said because I'm a knucklehead like that? No, I actually, this one says, it says broken on this one. It's a fog machine. Um, what was I talking about? Gosh, Matt, you talk too much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the sign, the sign, the motorcycle sign. But you don't realize how hard it is to read when you're up close. Like that, when I edited that film, you could totally tell it was a motorcycle. I think this said Adidas. I think. Let's see. Yeah, that said Adidas at some point. Why don't you pull closer to your pie? Oh, look at that. I still got a magnet on the front of my car <laughs> from cleaning this stuff out this weekend. Ugh. I suppose I should move that back into the trailer. <laughs> See? You guys think I don't work on the weekends. Look at this. I got a magnet that's been on the front of my car this whole ride. You come back here to the trailer, brother. That's too funny. See how strong those are? Yeah, I use the head of my car as a tool bench. I know, probably not the best use, but you do what you gotta do. What did I say this weekend? Oh, my wife went and got her feet done over the weekend. And so my son came down and he said, where's mom at? I said, She's getting her, she's getting her feet did. He's like, why do you say did? He's like, that's past tense. He's like, she's getting her feet done. I'm like, hey kid, that's past tense too, by the way. <laughs> he just smiled at me. <laughs> Dumb kids. Oh, I don't want to put that there. I need to put the stove there. <laughs> Oh my gosh, packing up piles. Look at this thing, man. You should have parked closer. Worst scrapper ever. I know, what are you gonna, are you gonna do? This is all like wires and, I don't know, this is like a, a crazy killer spot. Let's take this before people start yelling and screaming. I think I might keep that dishwasher and harvest parts out of it. I'm pretty sure that's the same one I've got. Or maybe I'll have to harvest parts out of it before I chuck it. It would be far cheaper than having to buy the motors and such. Still haven't figured out what's wrong with it. I did figure out, I did fix the shower though, by the way, guys. So if you're wondering and concerned about me having stanky kids, we got that faucet fixed. It wasn't bad at all. It was just kind of inconvenient. All right, let's get this beast in the trailer. Could we have a two trip Monday? Maybe, anything's possible. What are you stuck on? Right, here you go. Anything's possible. You come here, Mr. Tree. This is my working air compressor, right? Yes, it's gonna work. Put the stove there. I'm gonna put my dishwasher on top because we don't want it to get messed up. Oh yeah, these are actually metal. Samsung. Oh, the top's broken on. Ooh, those sound nice. Ah, no pots and pans.
on, drawer. Let him in there. What I hung up on. It's those stupid rails that I told you earlier. This is gonna be great. I'll get a washer and a dryer. There we go. Woo! That's a little different. Might have similar parts though. It also might be stainless, right? Whew, they're making me work hard this morning. It's supposed to ease into the week. The body's the body stainless. The door's not. So what's Jeff gonna count that as dirty? Ready? One, two, three. Yeah, let's not get that nasty, juicy water off of us. That's still gross. All right, onward. So, last stop on the trifecta. <laughs> I bet I would. I have a field day in my garage. <laughs> you don't want to see it. <laughs> hey, have a great day. That gentleman stopped down there at the last pile and was thanking me for saving stuff in the landfill and was talking about how much trash is out here and oh, you're broken. We'll take you anyways. You got metals in the middles. Um, and so, I was like, yeah, we, we do what we can. Uh, uh, this has got... Uh, it doesn't smell. It doesn't smell. That. Remember that chicken grill? I know you guys do. Nasty chicken grill. Yuck. <laughs> I can smell it just thinking about it. Gross. But he saw this pile up here. He's like, you're stopping up there? I'm like, yeah, I'm stopping up with all of them. They got stuff, so we're stopping. Oosh. Until we run out of room, which is never. And this weekend I found out too, a lot of times on these ones here, these twist. A lot of times they have nice breasts on them, but like these ones here, they're actually crimped. And it's next to nearly impossible to get that off. That one looks like a steel. I mean, sometimes they're aluminum, but normally they're either steel or brass. Don't waste your time. You'll just, you'll uh, give yourself a nightmare trying to get that off of there. Let's go. Probably nothing, but we have to take a look. This looks like a pool. I wanted to see what was in this one. Let's see what we got in here. <laughs> it's probably nothing. Oh, it's coax. <laughs> we'll take it. It's like, that's probably nothing. It's just a big, huge thing of wire. That's funny. Oh, I wish you were a good wire. <laughs> that'll really, that'll really send some guys over the edge when they're going through the pile. They're like, oh, someone threw wire out. And they'll dig through the pile and bang. Sheer disappointment. <laughs> so that's the kind of day it's gonna be. I love it. <laughs> We're stacking and strapping, baby. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Might be time to go unload. This is exactly why I didn't want to have to. Uh, have all that stuff in here to begin with. In case we had a day like this. So, we're gonna put Mr. Stove on top of here. And Mr. Dishwasher is gonna go right there. Looks like we're gonna have to go unload, kids. Yeah, it's gonna have to happen. 
I don't feel like fighting this all day, what do you say? Sounds like a playing mat. Not a road hazard, that was just a, a fall off. And now you guys are always after me. Dirty, dirty stainless. Dirty stainless. Dirty stainless. Dude, you take knobs off of these runs, too. Come on, bro. I'm not gonna bother you guys with the with the strap down, but well, you see me struggle. Put this up here first. Sounds like a plane, right? straps let's go all right you guys we've made it to the yard I decided oh there's a good pair decent halfway decent pair we'll take these ones um they're not great but they're better than what I was working with I don't have my good clippers every day. I was from cleaning stuff look at this stuff man we got one two three air conditioners in here boy people just leaving meat on the bone so I told Jeff he needed to start a series like that on what people drop off the yard that they could have made so much more money on. I think air conditioners are kind of a given, but clearly somebody, uh, somebody doesn't know. I don't know if I'm gonna have time to take this water heater or this pool heater apart. We just might just dump them and go. If you guys didn't realize, we were really bad last week about taking advantage of our bus. We got a bus today. We are definitely taking care of this one. Let's see if this is the same one or not. It's not for all my game. This is, this might be the same one. I want to take a look at this before I leave. It has a sealed bottom like mine. I 
is this guy covered up like this? What do you got down here, brother? Nothing too overly exciting. Where's our fake wires? Fake wires. We really don't have great stuff to throw out of it either. Should work though. Where's my, he's over here. Did I get a mower? I smell gas. Let me get a mower. Probably from this sweet V Becker that he said worked. That's where the gas is coming from. That's where the gas smell come from right there. We stay right there. Taking that home. Clippers. Why are you stuck in my back pocket, bro? Aye. We all got it. So much good garbage in here. <clears throat> okay, let's put them down here and see what happens. Makes a difference or not? Darn nice 
shape too. <clears throat> what is that? That was a, a bow and arrow. Sure. Where'd that come from? I don't remember picking that up. Hermes got nice loads today. Clippers. Oosh. Same window. Darn it, keep sticking to my hand. I guess they aren't very good clippers. They're giving me all, all kinds of a hard time. I missed. I was considering this, but I ain't doing that. I think it's just cute. I didn't even look it up. Hopefully you guys did. <sighs> Probably hate myself for it later. Someone's painting something in here. I smell paint now. Oh gosh. Here we go. 
you guys are we got to look at. All right, rest is staying. That's getting pushed off. I'm not breaking it down. We'll see you on the road. We got pretty empty. We left the pool heater in there. Um, we left some other tidbits that we weren't able to break down because tools are at the house. What kind of scrapper leaves are tools at the house? This guy right here. And it's been pretty sparse out here since uh, we got back out in the street. So hopefully things will change. Grab ourselves a little air fryer. These are the gloves that I found like, I don't know, a week or two ago. They're pretty nice. They're super, super broken. That's what I like about them. Like the leather's like super soft. It does have a hole or two, but they still work. And this, folks, right here is why we emptied. Can you imagine trying to fit this in the last load? Not gonna happen. This guy's pretty fat. Oh, good. Look at that. They took all the handles off for me and put them inside the refrigerator. They're probably all stainless. Hopefully, the rest of the refrigerator is too. here I don't think I'm gonna take that wheelbarrow although it's metal what do you got over here oh gosh that wood tried to trip me yeah that's because I'm not taking you what we got here what kind of toys we got her what are these lol things maybe maybe I don't know we're just gonna take it how does that sound survived the bombing of Pearl Harbor it's probably a library book uh, I don't need any pink guys what is this that's probably the horse's house it's a horse garage with a dog bone on it no nope, maybe not what do you think guys should we take the wheelbarrow or not uh, maybe we'll take it maybe let's fill up the back and make this car a bigger disaster than it already is them but one <sighs> what do you think guys let's check and see how heavy she is Uh, 
ball taker. What the heck? It's only got one, one handle. It's definitely not a keeper. Let's go. First random chair of the day. Wow. Took this long to find a random chair, huh? Mickey's gonna be pretty plastic, so he's staying. Shink. All right, guys, I had this wheelbarrow I decided not to take, but I saw this pile here. I was really concentrating on this pile and said, I really, no, I don't want a tube TV. Forget about this. And then I came and I was like, oh, a microwave. And then I realized there's a dang darn refrigerator over here. I totally didn't see. So I spun around just to make my life easier. And I parked up here so that way I can do a twofer without having to notice more than once. So, so sue me. Uh, I guess I'll at least get the cord off of that, uh, that there. Uh, tube TV while I'm here, huh? No food. Sweet. And yet, another reason on why we unloaded. <laughs> it would have been, would have been a no-go, I think. What do you guys think? I don't think we would have got two refrigerators in the last load. This refrigerator is a pain in the butt, man. He keeps getting caught up in everything. Come on, man. Work with me here. I don't know if we're going to be able to squeeze that in there. We might have to push everybody up. That is not going to fit there, kids. All right, I'm going to do some uh, situating. Because we didn't do a great job at the yard. So, I'll see you guys next time. Wowza, wowza, wowza. So, uh, I don't know why this one's here and that one's there, unless it's two different people. This is a nice washing machine. This will be like washing machine, uh, I think nine and ten. That are, we still haven't got rid of yet. Let's figure out how to all get off this thing. gonna get these in here and we'll move along you guys don't need to see me struggle I breathe heavy enough just walking around alrighty guys got ourselves another line of chair and you'll notice washer and dryer aren't there we had to put them up front we stayed in there too fat refrigerators are too fat wash machines are too fat can't go too wide you a fatter trailer <laughs> What a Monday, man. I watched uh, Dinosaurs with my kids again this weekend. The Good Dinosaur, I think it's called. It's the one with the Erlo, where his dad dies and stuff at the beginning. Um, and this reminds me of that. The storm will provide. In this case, the streets will provide. It's crazy how much is out here today. 
I was gonna throw that, but this is actually kind of heavy. I'm kind of surprised. I guess you're gonna go right there, brother. Because you were much heavier than I thought you were. I was just gonna toss you up top. That ain't happening. I'm getting weak from picking up all, all these metals. Come on, squeeze. Squeeze. Yeah, like a glove. Ah, let's get out. We're gonna take a quick peek here. Just for giggles. Yeah. And that's why you stop. Look at this thing. I think this is supposed to be like decorations to go with this box. Jeff would like that box. Let's take this to Jeffy. That's right up his alley. These are like for decorations, I think. That's not actually scrap. That's for uh, someone that's trying to make their place look, uh, what's it called? Look at that box. There was a fancy toy in there. Castle playset. That was expensive. It was a vintage buzz lot. Actually, probably not vintage, probably brand new. But this is like for industrial shelves and stuff, I think. It's pretty cool looking. All right. Ooh, squeezing through here. Let's go. Had to run back real quick. This looked like it had some decor inside this box. What's up, Nacho Nature? What we got here? These are for ceilings. To make your ceiling fans look fancy. You're not in there. These things probably cost $15 a piece. I know, and I just stopped right in the middle of the road. <laughs> I was like, Arr! hang on, I gotta see. Let's go. This is just crazy. I hope Packer Scrapper's doing well too. I called him this morning and said, hey, you out? And he said, I'm out. Well, those are all pots and pans. Holy smokes. And they got something down there too. All the stuffs. Okay, where are we going with the stuff? <laughs> Over here, I guess. <coughs> and our first loo is pretty decent too. We got a second one working. What is this? I think this might be more queer, maybe. Simply smarter. Yeah, that feels like a pool heater. Activate warranty, what are you? Pool heater! Dose pool heaters in one day, are you kidding me? Well, get out of here, lizard. Go on, go put your ass. No, not in the street, you big dummy. <clears throat> Okay, where are we gonna go with you? You're gonna have to come over here. Who y'all? Go your heavy. Oh my gosh, where are we gonna go with this? Right there. Then we'll hit another strap, right? Oh, Let's go. Oops, forgot my clippers. So my uh, one of my pool heaters fell off. I didn't start to hear anything before I backed in. There's a couple of people here in the yards. Got a very small hole. That bus is gone now. That's crazy. We have some uh, new cars here, but nobody got no windows. I talked to Kev. Kev did well today, that's good to hear. 
which means we both did well. Can't complain about that, now can we? Not like this guy had. Some stuff's on the inside, but I feel like that should be stainless. It's not. You ain't got nothing. I already got the... You know what's the regulator off of that one. Whew, this fridge stinks too. What's that? Mm -mm. I love the fell of a rotten fridge in the morning. point keep it secure This we need to get the doors off of. Oh. <clears throat> Try and squish me. steals my doors because he well I won't be paying attention the next thing you know that's plowed away
Oh, ah, yeah. Come on, man. There we go. Oosh. It's a warm one, folks. Get ready done digging out from the snow yet. Believe it or not, folks, that's it. We're gonna see if we can take these pool heaters taken apart, this thing is taken apart. We can go from there. I'll see you guys over at Jeffy's. Let's do some NFJ! Soon to be just Jeff. <laughs> Check it load, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Was that just Jeff? <laughs> Which ones? Yeah, 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 yeah. There's clean in here. That's clean. That's clean. That was almost clean until it stripped. You know, you can use the end of my bin to break it. Yeah. Let's do this dirty. Clean. That's clean. That's the new way in. Alright. You want this in there too, Jeff? I'm gonna clean that up. So, are you donating the bikes? 
These ones are just in really great. These are in really awesome shape. Yeah, I mean, they're, and they're both Schwinn's too. Probably outgrew them. Yeah. Probably what happened. Oh, look at that car. Yeah. That's another full. That's a no. I got two full Hoodies today. That's why I said you got to get your prices up. It'd be a really nice to be able to turn this stuff in over here. But they won't take all your other stuff. What's that? Shred. You're right. They won't take shred. They No, they don't take shred at all, I don't think. Yeah. This is this is for you. Oh, thank you. I'll take that over. It's the garden gardener's eating on it. Oh, she's got potatoes on the windowsill uh -huh. and avocado seeds that have sprouted. Okay. Really good. Um, now you got a bin. <laughs> yeah. Above my pay grade. Above my pay grade. Oh, you didn't get this either. I'm missing all kind of dirty here, dude. Good. It's all hidden. Hey, yeah. Say what? At least it's somewhat organized. A little bit. He said number two. Yeah, but you're doing it at 250 number one. But he's there. They probably buy for number two and then toss it in the number one. Probably. There's no paint, solder. Yeah, they're really, for them though, if it's not bright, bright. If it's not bright, it's number two all the time. And I, that's why I asked. I said, is it going to be a one or two? He said, it'll be two. So it'll be 320 versus 330. Yeah. Yeah, no. A bonus. I get, it, I get it, brother. I get it. Hey, I, but I got to give you, I got to give you a hard. Like I got to give you a hard time, though. I know. Yeah. As long as it's not far off. I mean, it's. Yeah, yeah that's way too far. <clears throat> It's no different than Dominion over on the coast. Huh? They're at 875 for shred. Where? Dominion. Dominion, that's down in Florida, right? Yeah. Here. Here. I wonder if they have a, a shredder. I don't know. Usually if you have a shredder, right. you can pay more than the two Right. Right. That certainly makes your life a lot easier. Because all you guys send it out up to Jacksonville? You guys send it all up to Jacksonville for the most part anyways, right? Our number one steel goes to Jacksonville. Okay. It's like halfway between here. I know where Frost is this. Yeah. Okay. That's not going to go as clean, right? Yeah. Yeah, I got to clean it up then. Oh, here's another one more dirty. I missed. <laughs> oh! I hope it, I hope so. I need one. Mine's not this big. I need one that's got more oh, juice. More so I want it, I'm hoping it works. I have mine still, I'm not getting rid of it until I decide if I want to buy another. Plasma or not? Yep. You still got that? Nah, I just started taking it apart. Ah. Okay. I just lopped all the wires and everything off oh, of it, but it's done. But done, done. Yeah. Done, done. I bet I made 25 grand, 30 grand with that machine in my garage. 
That's crazy. That's great content Yeah. You need to get a case like this. It doesn't have the glass over your your end. Well, that's GoPro, so I don't know if they make that. I, th I, I would look. This is a GoPro that makes that. Yeah, I know, but I would look and see if they have the outside mount. That's what people are talking about. You're getting the f fog from Matches, the yeah. from the case, not from your camera. Right. No, it just picks so up. Hot. It just picks up dirty easier. Yeah. Well, see, on the computer, it looks fine. Yeah. You know, when we're doing all that stuff, it looks fine. Yeah. So. That's it for me, brother. I'll look and see if there's because that won't fit in your case. What's that? I, I don't that. That won't fit in your case. No, I think we'll see you guys at checkout. Alrighty. We're waiting paid. What a day. I'm loving a two-run Monday, man. So we uh killed it today. Didn't have any picker still again, or not really anything too exciting picker-wise, but Man, there was there stuff out there, and Kevin killed it too. I think he did two loads. He one of his loads was from the weekend, but he had a nice chunky load for Kevin. Kevin doesn't send it to stack too high, but he had a chunky, chunky load. So I think the two of us really cleaned up in that uh, area today. It's nice because it's been kind of sporadic, good, bad, ugly, but uh, we'll take it, man. So let's jump into the receipt. First load was just 10, because we did kept the stuff that we didn't, we didn't have time to stop to see Jeffy. We didn't have much Don Ferris anyway, so we just uh, dumped and ran. And we actually kept all the other stuff, like the bike and the uh, air compressor and things that we need to test out. So that's still back there. Uh, first load of 10, 1,300 pounds. Six cents a pound for 78 bucks that we ran back out and about. And we found some more stuffs. We dropped off a wash. Uh, actually, those were two dryers. I thought one was a washer, one was a dryer. They were both dryers. Uh, I dropped both those off at my uh, my guy's place um, on uh, IOU. <laughs> so we're gonna count him as forty bucks. Cause that's what he's gonna pay me when he does pay me. He's got a lot of things going on. So I just I wanted to get rid of them. And they were on the. They were even in the trailer. They were on the trailer. <laughs> So I wanted to get rid of them. So I got rid of them and uh, we'll catch it with them eventually. I'm not really that worried about it. Uh, and then we came back to the yard. 10, 1,220 pounds. A little bit lighter than our first one. But uh, that's because we stud some non-ferrous in the trailer. And uh, it's just what it is what it is. I guess we had some thicker stuff in that first load. Six cents a pound for 73.20. Uh, irony lights were like Swiffer handles and a screen, I think. Just uh, some pots and pans. Miscellaneous. Oh, I'm tired. 18 pounds, 25 cents a pound for 450. Um, irony heavy. Oh, was all of the doors to that refrigerator, the stainless steel refrigerator. Um, you know what? He didn't pay me on my sealed unit, just stink wide. Irony heavy, 86 pounds, 15 cents a pound for 12.90. And clean aluminum. I don't know what he stole. He stole something out of my trailer. Oh, that's probably more pots and pans that were clean. Uh, four pounds, 36 cents pound for a dollar 44 for a grand total of 1704 plus our washer and dryer. Gives us a day at 210. How do you like them apples? I'm loving it. And we still got all that copper in the back from the pool heaters that we didn't turn in. One of the, I don't know if you heard me say or not, I, I called him just Jeff. Um, uh, Keb was in front of me at line, so I ran in there and was giving Jeff a hard time and said, when is the price of copper going to go up. I want to do a non-ferrous Friday. I'm not turning it in here if your prices are horrible. Because I'd called around and there's much better prices elsewhere. I would really like to prefer to turn into the yard I'm working with, but I can't leave that much money on the table. It's one thing if it's five, ten cents a pound. It's another thing in this particular case, 80 cents a pound. That's some money. So they're going to have to up their prices. So I was just busting as I said, if you can't get your non-ferrous prices up, you're just going to turn into just Jeff. You're going to lose the non-ferrous. <laughs> <laughs> so I like, I like busting on Jeff, giving him a hard time. And I'm going to go back and bust on it because he didn't put my sealed units in there. I did have two sealed units out of his refrigerator. So this will be on tomorrow's ticket because I want to go uh, remind him about that. So hope you guys enjoyed the content. If you did, make sure to smash that thumbs up. Please consider subscribing if you're not already a subscriber. We'd love to see you here each and every day. We do this as long as weather's permitting. 
it's not show stuff. But that doesn't mean you can't take someone else's trash and turn it into cash. So until tomorrow, be safe, be happy, and I'll catch y'all then.